83-year-old Ron Akana is believed to be the longest-serving flight attendant in the United States. In uh, 1949, United uh, was looking for some stewards. I showed up for along with 400 other applicants, and uh, we applied for eight positions. Uh, I looked around and thought, I'll never get this job. There's <laughs> 400 other guys, half of them had coats and ties. All I had was an Aloha shirt. My name is Ron Akana, and I've uh, been with United for 63 years. I'm number one in seniority in United, and uh, I enjoy it. I've flown probably uh, in excess of 10 to 15 million miles. This was a uniform that we uh, first had. This is me up in this corner here. He was one of the first male stewards to work the state-of-the-art Boeing Stratocruiser, which was built in the 1940s and featured a bar on the lower deck. I've had many of the Hollywood people on board. I, I brought the whole cast of From Here to Eternity, Burt Lancaster, Frank Sinatra, uh, Montgomery, Cliff. Mm. Believe it or not, this is one soldier's got a real big family, 15 of them. Burt Lancaster had 12 or 13 martinis, then came and bartended with me as if he hadn't had one. I mean, this guy was tough, not, you know, genuine tough guy, I think. Seniority in the airlines gives flight attendants the power to choose their schedules. These days, Mr. Akana chooses to fly the Denver-Hawaii route, which gives him a chance to visit his childhood home. A decade ago, he was among the highest paid flight attendants at United, earning $106,000 a year in salary, pension, and social security. He jokes that flying is how he earns his vacation money, and he's not quite ready to give up working, but he has started to consider retirement. Aloha means uh, hello, mm -hmm. goodbye, I love you. Uh, so in this case, it's uh, goodbye. Mm -hmm. And we're going to miss him. We're going to miss him. It makes me start to cry. <laughs> We're going to miss him.